Hello my gorgeous mortals and welcome back to my channel. This here is going to be my review series and yes you can see that it is my homepage for YouTube sitting on my screen right now. Um, well, I guess it's your screen it's sitting on because, well, you're the one watching the video. This is a review series where I'm going to be reviewing uh, different YouTube channels. I'm part of a small channel YouTube group. I say small channel, I mean I'm the tiny one at 32, and some of them have a couple hundred, but whatever. And I'm going to be reviewing their channels. I will point out the positive and the negative. So essentially the good, the bad, and the ugly. Hopefully we don't find anything ugly. But you know what? We'll take a look. We'll see what happens. So without further ado, let's take a look at just what the quality of this channel is. Uh, spoiler alert, not that great. Okay, so first off, let's take a look at the quality of his branding. I don't really know what is going on here too much. Uh, that is a nice font. Uh, I do like the Algerian, clearly, since this is my channel we're reviewing, and it's what's being used. Uh, now, with the header there, it's, it's just a very simple pattern with some words over top of it. I recommend this YouTuber get some art up there to showcase and to get some more branding. Uh, now, if we take a look at his avatar, that's actually, I can't really complain too much, that's a fairly well done piece of art. Uh, but I have the inside track here. I know that he didn't do that himself, and then he should probably change that, because that's not the logo he wants. Uh, he only has one feature channel. Okay, that's interesting, he should do more. There's not that many related channels. Hmm, that's interesting. 32 subscribers. Uh, and if we take a look down to see what he has for videos down below. If we take a look at his videos, uh, the thumbnails leave me wanting more. That, although that uh, the Rage thumbnail is pretty good, um, it appears that he has both gameplay and vlogging material. Uh, so let's dive into one of these videos and take a look and see what it's like. Okay, this is the intro here. Pretty good intro, if I do say so myself. I like it. Um, clearly, it's mine. I paid some money for it. Ooh, that long gap between. That should not be there. That is bad. Uh, the video is quite shaky. Thank you for the explanation of the hand over the camera. Although, not the best idea to be doing that. You want to try to keep your target in frame, so pointing it down at the ground is not a great idea. The point of the video wasn't made very clear, so I'm not entirely sure what's going on here. Like, I'm assuming this guy is Raven, and those are the livestock, clearly. What, what's the point here? Is it supposed to be funny? I don't see anything. I do like the addition of a really cute dog. Hi, puppy! Hello! Ah, such a beautiful dog. Okay, so... Remember Monty Python? Um, no, not really. So... <laughs> I did try to warn him here, but he didn't pay attention. So I think we finally found the focus of the video. Uh, it's quite a lengthy way in. Ooh, not good. Not good at all. Even some editing could have cut that down. But nope, no editing was chose to be done here. Okay, so it's quite a ways into the video that we finally reached the point of the video. It appears that the point of this video was to be commentary on the fact that this guy is scared of a rabbit. Although, judging by the fact he's trying to bite, I don't blame him. Oh, at least they have an end card. End cards are great for any channel because it helps redirect traffic to another video or another section of YouTube that you want them to see. Uh, with the two videos here, that's good. With the subscribe button. Perfect. Okay, so we're moving on to the second video. It has a different intro. Which I'm just realizing, I put the wrong intro on that video. <laughs> ah, that's supposed to be the gameplay intro, not the vlogging intro. The vlogging intro we've seen should be the one here. Now, now recording in a car, especially while driving, uh, while driving, it's just not safe to begin with. I'm pretty sure that's distracted driving and illegal in my province. But shh, don't tell the police <laughs> that I did that. Uh... See, look at that lens flare. It's horrible to get consistent lighting while driving in a car because you're constantly moving and the lighting's always changing. So I don't recommend doing that. However, judging by the analytics on my channel, I do recommend doing that. Hey, look, you just saw some editing. That is good. No, that wasn't done during the review. That was actually done in the video itself. Must I cut out a chunk. That is good. Always cut out chunks that are uninteresting so that people don't click away. 
the background noise of this video isn't ruins a lot of this because of course there's background music not music noise which of course is a, a problem with recording in a vehicle such as this because you have the sounds that come from outside the car unless you have one of those new fancy ones that apparently make it silent inside but i don't have one of those it's a 2005 so uh you don't want that kind of a noise that's just not good not good the audio quality also isn't all that great unfortunately but oh well See, look at that terrible lighting. And as you see there, I tap on my phone. Clearly distracted driving to try and fix it. See, looking at the phone more than I should be at the road. Although it is a straight and there was nobody on the road, so that's why I did it. I'm a very safe driver. Be quiet. <laughs> we see some more end card action. That is good. Uh, we see a link to the vlog that we just reviewed as well. And again, some gameplay on the left-hand side for the gameplay series. Alright, next up is a gameplay video. We see that intro again. I like it. Some, well, Raven's complained about it, but you know what? I don't care. I like it. Hey, everybody, I'm Raven, by the way. Wasteland Legends with Raven. First thing I have to say about this video is, holy crap, the audio quality isn't that great. And knowing that this is a whole series, I know the audio quality isn't going to be good for any of them because we didn't change the setup at all, and... But you know what, that is a mic problem, <laughs> I can tell you that right now, and it was just terrible, horrible setup. Firstly, I'm going to apologize, and I'm going to say, mm, it's terrible, bad, and I'm not going to change it because I can't change it right now, unfortunately. In a few months, when I have uh, some more money saved up, I will be buying a new mic. Thankfully, the recording software that they use is okay, so you can see a great video behind that even if the commentary audio is quite crap uh you can hear uh enough of the gameplay audio as well but it's not too loud so as to overshadow the commentary as well that is a good balance congratulations uh a lot of the channels that i have been talking about recently to their creators not on my channel during this series because the series just started of course uh that has been a major problem, and I expect to see a little bit more of that in the future in the series, of that being a problem. But other than that, that is uh, a great way to capture video. Uh, the split screen is a little bit... Ugh, but then again, you are doing a split screen game, so I don't think that can be avoided in this case. Personally, I don't like watching a video like that, because I don't know which screen to look at. But, you know what, that's just me again. It, there, you could possibly record just the top or just the bottom or switch between them as cool things happen, but that requires too much editing, and I am lazy for that. The end card makes a return again. I like that. Uh, this time, he, the creator is actually talking on the right and talking about it. See, and he's actually pointing. It's a little bit more interactive, uh, except I don't think it really works with this setup of an end card, which is why this is the only video that really shows me pointing. I think, maybe, possibly? No, I'm wrong. There is another video out there. Uh, although, that video that they're showing there, that was just horrible, oh dear lord. I will never let Raven be my cameraman again! Holy shit, is he bad at it. Okay, I know you can't hear it at home. But uh, there was audio there, so it wasn't just them leaving unedited, quiet bits there on uninteresting screens. I'm going to leave that there because, again, there's commentary over it. Uh, the intro for this gameplay video was the same as the last two that we've reviewed. This is a triple kill challenge. I do like the fact that they added a, uh, a challenge videos to their channel. Uh, I like challenge videos, so I'm glad to see this here. I hope to see more from this person. Uh, spoiler, there might be. <laughs> I am doing quite well this match. Yeah, that's typical for when I say shit like that. <laughs> oh, fuck me! What the ever-loving hell? I do like it when a YouTuber is able to poke fun at themselves, especially during gameplay videos when they know that they aren't doing too terribly great. Uh, because, you know what? A little bit of self-deprecation goes a long way. Ooh, nice shot. Uh... I just got distracted. Wonderful. I am totally professional. I have no idea what you're talking about. The fact that I got distracted there might actually go to show that this is actually an interesting bit of content. That even while watching it for a review, I get distracted by watching it. 
Ooh, maybe, possibly, or no, <laughs> probably not. Stretching it too far, maybe. Let me know in the comments below. That's another thing that this channel is missing that I've noticed too, is that there isn't as much uh, community interaction as I would like to see. Uh, so if there were some more shoutouts to comments, oh wait, there's a video on that. Maybe I should put that in there. Yeah, I'll review that too. So unfortunately, the challenge was not completed during the regular video segment. Uh... No, I should have had that kill! Okay, maybe reacting like that was a little uncalled for. However, I do like how the fact at the end here, I'll just quickly jump to that. They added in them finally completing the challenge. Oh, um, spoiler alert, see? There's the first kill for the triple kill. They can take that guy out. Now, they may not actually live through this, but ta-da! They finish it. And then it zooms in. That's a nice tie-in at the end. And it just leads right into the end card. Uh, I've taken the music out, but there is music playing throughout all of that. There was no commentary, because it was recorded after the fact. Okay, now let's talk description. There's nothing in the description that's actually said about the video in a lot of those, actually. You should always have a little blurb in your description about the actual video before you go into promoting all of your other stuff. But then again, that's just how I personally feel, and clearly, it's I don't feel it's too terribly important because I haven't done it! Why haven't I done it? Come on! This brings to mind the old saying, those who can't do, teach. I clearly can't do. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave a like, comment, and a subscribe. Okay, so what else is missing from this channel? It's a unique sign-off. It sounds just like everybody else who's just starting out. Uh, but that's something you can work on. And that's the point of these review channels, just know where people can improve. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this review channel. If you want your channel reviewed, please leave a like, comment, or subscribe. Uh, shoot me a message on YouTube, whatever. Bye. Another critique of this channel. Holy crap! Is the desk when I when I vlog from the desk, um, the light is lighting is junk. Yeah. Well. Oh well. See my Xbox and on the TV behind me. TV that also doubles as a monitor for my new computer. If you've been watching, if not, hey, you know what? That will be the annotation. Click here to see the unboxing. And yes, uh, both videos. Uh, over there and over there, uh, they're the exact same, so 50% chance that one of those was pointing off to where there was no video. Oh well, uh, I'm not putting an actual proper end card here, logging to my videos, because I've already done that within the annotations within the video to those respective videos, which I will be doing for the other channels as well. I'm not just going to be trying to take... You know, everything and not credit them. Mama, banana, banana, banana. I will also be taking off mute, taking out the music for everything, of course, because I don't want to try and credit. Like, in mine, I could credit it because I am allowed to use the music, but I don't want to set a precedent that I can't follow through with every other video. Uh, if you have any comments about this particular video or anything else about my channel, did I miss something in the review? Please leave a comment down below. Thank you so much for watching. I love you all. Love. Wait, I already did the whole end thing. Now I'm doing a weird outro. I don't know. Is this the unique sign-off? Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Chances are you've clicked away already. If you're still here, bless your soul.